Fibroids are benign growth of the uterus. These uh, grow on all layers and aspects of the uterus. They can be on the outside of the uterus, through the muscle, or protrude into the uterine cavity. Fibroids are actually very common, and about 80% of women may experience a fibroid in their lifetime. Similarly, polyps are gross of the endometrial lining that protrude into the uterine cavity. Fibroids and polyps need to be assessed because they can interfere with your fertility by impinging in the space where, on the inside of the uterus where the embryo is trying to attach to. They can also distort the cavity and block the fallopian tubes. By distorting the cavity, we can also have an increased risk of miscarriage. So symptoms that might alert you to whether or not you have a fibroid or polyp present include abnormal vaginal bleeding or pelvic pain. If you're affected by a fibroid or polyp, it is important that you see a fertility specialist to see whether or not they need to be removed at all. Treatment can range from simple day surgery to more complex surgery. This can either be keyhole surgery, which is called laparoscopic surgery, or open surgery, which is called laparotomy. So either of these operations can be planned for by your fertility specialist. Now, of course, not everybody needs surgery, so it may be simply a matter of knowing about the fibroid and having it assessed and then continuing to try to achieve a pregnancy without any surgery. If you're under 35 years of age and have been trying to conceive for more than 12 months without success, or if you're over 35 years of age and have been trying for six months, it may be to your benefit to discuss things with one of our IVF Australia specialists. Please feel welcome to look at our website and contact one of our clinics.